Here's a story straight from the heart. Most of the time, strangers don't necessarily go out of the way to help one another. But one person in Macon sure did. Jaden Veal started his summer lawn service business last year. He usually cuts grass around downtown Macon in the Bells Hill neighborhood. That's when Eric Maley saw Veal pushing a lawnmower down the road in the hot sun. So Maley asked if he could help. Maley loaded up his equipment and drove him a mile down the road to where he was going to mow another yard. During that car ride, Maley was inspired to help even more by providing a bike and a cart with the help of Centenary United Methodist Church. It was a small thing to, to help Jaden. Uh, really, we were uh, just in the right place at the right time. We saw someone who uh, was, is an entrepreneur, and so we wanted to invest uh, uh, and help him to develop his, uh, his, his small business that he has started. So uh, it, was an easy, it was an easy decision. They ordered the card online. It should arrive sometime next week. For Vail's contact information, go to 13WMAZ.com. Folks gathered at Georgia College in Milledgeville to celebrate the sound of music because today marks International Make Music Day. Teachers, students, and music lovers got together on the school's lawn. Organizers set up several gongs and percussionists played them for an hour. Music department chair Don Parker says the goal is to give off positive energy as the world tries to return to normal after the coronavirus pandemic. People would like to forget a lot of things that they've had to do <clears throat> and get back to some sense of normalcy. Well, this allows us to be able to kind of make that transition. When we hear this gong, when we hear that sound and we hear it dissipate, it kind of, it's kind of a relaxing, calming sound. Yeah, I agree, I like that. Make Music Day is celebrated all around the world on June 21st, the summer solstice.